All right, good day, students. So I'll be going through the solutions for addition and subtraction, the class rate that you were given. Some of you did it, some didn't. And just to ensure that you can do your worksheet properly, I'm giving the answers now, plus some feedback based on what I see persons doing. So our first question, part A, says negative 6K plus 7K. All right, and this is simple. The terms are already alike, so we don't have an issue. We should use the rule same signs, add and keep. Different signs subtract, the signs are different. So that is subtract, subtracting, we get 1K. And that's positive, so equals 1K. Or of course, we know that 1K is the same as K. So that's your final answer. You can pause the video so that you can take that off. B said n plus 10 plus 9n minus 3. Are there any like terms? Yes, they are. n and 9n, 10 and negative 3. You group the like terms n plus 9n. I saw somebody write um, negative n or and someone else did negative 9n. You cannot do that because um, you have to, if it's already a positive 9 in the question, you have to keep it as a positive 9. Then we put the constants together because those are like terms uh, by themselves. N plus 9N, same signs add and keep. Remember that if you don't see a coefficient, the coefficient is 1. So this is indeed 10N. Different signs subtract. Answer takes a sign of the larger. That's positive 7. 10N plus 7. You may pause and write off. C says 4P plus 2P minus 17Q minus 73Q. Let me show you something that someone did. They did this, 4P plus 2P equals negative 17Q minus 73Q. Put in the answers in different lines. And then at the last part, they have negative 90Q. So you see that their answer doesn't even have a P in it. So that can work. When you are putting the like terms together, you're doing that in the same line, all right? So 4P plus 2P. Um, by the way, these are already like terms. So, but the point is when you're working them out, they must stay in the same line. All right, 4P plus 2P gives 6P. Same signs add and keep people. So this is not just 90Q, this is negative 90Q. Add the numbers, keep the sign. You cannot be subtracting the numbers. Walk yourself through the um through the answers when you through the rules when you're doing the answers. All right. Next we have 2x plus 10 plus 6 plus 45 minus 50. All right, 6x, sorry. So most persons would have grouped the like terms. Mm -hmm. Plus 10, I address the fact that you need to maintain the signs that are in front of them already. Uh -oh. All right, 2x plus 6x, 8x, most persons did that. And then some persons did this, plus 55, minus 50, and they totally left the answer like that. If you realize these are like terms, and so you also need to simplify further, plus five. Do not try to simplify this any further though, eight x plus five. All right, so that's your final answer. Next question. 200s plus 400s minus 600, uh, 600s. All right, so here we go. Two. 200s plus 400s, all of these are like terms, all of them are s. So you go ahead and you add these two, 600s, and somebody did this and left this as the answer. All right, they are like terms, so you're gonna finish it with the answer is zero. Even if you're at zero s, please go ahead and write the final answer, which is zero. All right, you don't have to write zero s any at all, you can skip that step completely. But 600s minus 600s is nothing. It's something subtract itself that's zero. 
12R minus 8 minus 12. Um, I see people have negative 8 as the answer, which means them does the 12 minus 12, and those aren't even like terms. That is 12R, and that's negative 12. All right. So here we go. The like terms are all ready together. So then they, so you have to keep 12R by itself, negative 8 minus 12. I don't know people have negative 4 and then something there. Same signs, add and keep. All right. Some prices put the numbers at the front. Oh, let me mention this now. When you do your answers, try to leave your constants at the back. The, the terms with the letters go to the front, and this is the last thing that you, you try to keep that at the back. All right, so 12R minus 20. 4X minus 10X, guys. Something as simple as this. It's just different signs of track. You cannot be getting 14. All right. You have four dollars and you owe somebody ten dollars. Yeah, there's no way you can have fourteen dollars left. Or you owe fourteen dollars. That makes sense. All right. Four x minus ten x. This is already a positive four x. Mm -hmm. So you just go different signs of track and set x the sign of the larger. Done. All right. And then we have negative v plus twelve v plus eleven r minus twelve r. For the persons who rewrote this to put the um the R is at the front, and this is how you rewrite. You can't change this to negative 11 R because this first thing is negative. That negative sign is for the V, all right? So here we go. Um, this is now 11 R, that's a positive 11 R, minus 12 R. And if we're putting the Vs at the back, then this is negative V plus 12 V, all right? Otherwise, you wouldn't, you don't have to do that, but um, otherwise, the terms would have been alike beside each other already. All right. <clears throat> so this would have been negative 1R, different sign subtract. And for negative 1R, we just put <coughs> negative R. Negative V plus 12V, different sign subtract. And so take the sign of the larger positive 11V. And we are coming down. Our next question is 6. Not 16, sorry. 1B minus 10 plus B plus 2. This is where some persons say, all right, then I'll put the B them together. 1B and then they write minus B. This minus, again, this minus right here, so it's for the 10. All right, so this is a positive B, and I eat right here from here, so it has to be a positive B. Minus 10 plus 2. Can I give you 12? This is negative 8. 1B plus 1B again. There's a different ink for that. Right? And so you would actually get 2B minus 8. And for our final question, negative 4 plus 3 plus 6A. Minus 4B. Plus 10, what do you do? Put the like terms together. What are the like terms then? Negative 4, positive 3, positive 10. 6A, oh, this was a plus 6A in the question. 6A and negative 4B, them are the like terms, so don't try to add them. They stay 6A minus 4B. Put everything else together. Again, 6A minus 4B, you're not trouble it. All right, I don't know how you want to do this. If you want to put the positives together and say that is negative four plus 13, or if you wanted to say negative four and three come together to be negative one plus 10, both would give you the same answer mm -hmm. of positive nine. All right, 6a minus 4b plus nine and that's it for our answers um not too bad so i hope that you will take these corrections and also use them to help you to do your worksheet if you already do your worksheet please go ahead and make corrections if you would like 